Why are you here? You want to know what I think? I think you were looking for some truth. And you thought I could give it to you. It's not about why they shot him. It's about who you are and who they are. <laughs> wait, you can't just leave him here. Our fingerprints are all over. You aided in the murder of an innocent man. You know? No, no, wait, wait a minute. That's, that's, I, I didn't touch him. Truth is, you flinch. That's my brother! When you're at the bank and two homies walk in. You're not surprised when you get cut off. There's an Asian behind the wheel. A young man was lynched, and I need answers. You're scared. When the plane's about to take off, and Osama sits next to you with his towel-head wife. You hold your breath as they pass by. No one tells us to feel this way. Why don't you go to the fried chicken place down the street, all right? <laughs> we just feel it on our own. This is a threat to every black student on this, this campus. This is an isolated incident. The Kappa House has a history of racism that oh everyone God. seems to acknowledge, except this administration. Television only mirrors reality. It's our experiences that tell us that there are good people and there are bad people. I'm telling you all the things that you think, but you won't say. It's not, it's not their poverty. It's not their lack of education that makes them criminals. No one goes to the ghetto and passes out guns. It's just them. Everybody around here doesn't have to stand on political correctness. You think you can say that kind of thing because you're black? <laughs> yes.